boleh tak boleh tak awak cakap slow sikit Awak cakap slow sikit Awak cakap Boleh is scan Tak is from word tidak Which means not Awak is you speak Hello guys, thank you so much for watching and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be doing a different kind of video. It's not really a reaction, but I will still be watching a video. This was actually requested, um, suggested by one of my subscribers and also um, my friend in Instagram to be learning some Malay phrases. And I find it really interesting because you know that I've already been doing a lot of covers in Malay and I'm not really sure, I'm not confident with my pronunciation of the words. So now is the right time for you guys to correct um, my way of, of making um, sounds in Malay. And this is gonna be a perfect video for me to um, watch while I'm trying to copy her. Yeah, I'm very excited. So let's go. One, two, go. Hi, it's me Tina Amir and welcome to my channel. So for today we're gonna to learn our new lesson which is about 20 Malay useful phrases. But before I begin, for this video I'm just gonna use informal pronunciation for those of you who are not clear yet about informal pronunciation or formal pronunciation, please watch my number 53 video okay. which is about confusing pronunciation. For this video, we're gonna learn only 20 phrases. Maybe for some other time, we're gonna continue again. First okay. word is yes. In Malay, yes, yes is ye or yes. slang ha ha. Ye ha. Number two, ha -ha. no. So no is <coughs> is from the word tida, tak. which means oh. no or not. So for example, if you in the restaurant and you want to order a drink and you wanted to say no sugar for your drink. So no sugar is tak de gula. Gula is sugar. So for this one, tak, tak de, gula. de gula. But for example, if you want to say you're not okay, I'm not okay. Tak Saya tak okay. Gula. So tak okay, tak de gula. Don't say tak, okay. tak gula. That's not correct. We normally say tak de gula. Tak de, de is gula. from the word tidak plus ada. I'm saying it right. Tak de gula. Oh plus I'm ada, embarrassing myself right now. Which tiada. That's the formal Malay pronunciation. Informal one is tiada. But then for speaking, we just say tak de. So tidak plus ada, tiada. Or tiada and then become takde. So takde gula, no sugar. Number three, maybe. Oh, so maybe is mungkin. There's a song mungkin. but it's called mungkin. Number four, always. In Malay, oh, so selalu. Always. Selalu. Some people don't that really that say song has selalu. They say selalu. selalu. You cut that selalu. selalu or selalu. selalu. Okay. But normally for speaking, selalu. Number selalu five, or tak selalu. pernah. Tak pernah. Tak from the word tak tidak, pernah. which means not. When you say tak pernah, pernah, sometimes R is not even audible. H is very soft. So it's up to you. Tak pernah or tak pernah. Both tak are pernah. correct for speaking, okay. which means never. Tak Number pernah. six, sometimes. So sometimes in Malay is kadang kadang. You kadang, read it because kadang. kadang kadang. Not it's only like a kadang, game but kadang kadang. You know, sometimes. The bamboo, How you want to um, say of course to somebody? Of course it is dah tentu. Dah from the word sudah, which tentu. means already. Tentu is like really something is sure. Tentu. So dah tentu, of course. Tentu. But somehow not everybody like to say the word dah tentu. We also say mesti. Mesti actually mesti. means must. But sometimes we just replace it with the dah tentu. Oh. Mesti or mestilah. For example, mesti somebody complain you, you look happy to do. Then you say mestilah. That's of course. But mesti, actually English word is must. When somebody complain when you like, oh you look happy to do. And then you say must. That's not how it is, you know. It's okay. like of course in English. Mesti. Mestilah. For other things it mesti means lah. must. 
Love has no meaning. So, mesti, mestilah, oh, dah tentu. Number A, sure. Sure is pasti. So, are you sure or not? Pasti. pasti. Number 9, I think pasti. so. Think in Malay is fikir. But I think so in Malay for expression, for speaking. We normally say rasanya, rasanya, or saya rasa, I think. I think saya rasa, rasa. Saya rasa. Is that correct? actually feel or taste. We don't really say right. saya fikir. We say saya rasa or rasanya and then you mention your full sentence. Number 10, please. Please is tolong or sila. For further details sila. about this one, sila. please check out my video regarding please. Number 11, sila. congrats. So congrats is Oh, tanya. I always see tanya. this. Number tanya. 12, Bye. Bye in Malay is selamat tinggal. So, selamat, selamat is tinggal. safe. Tinggal is selamat tinggal. But it's too long. We Malay prefer to say bye. Tinggal. Number 13. See you again. See jumpa or lihat. You bye. is awak. Again is lagi. But in Malay, when you say see you again, we just awak. say jumpa lagi. We don't say jumpa awak lagi. We just say jumpa lagi. If you want to say to somebody, see you tomorrow, then you just say jumpa esok. Jumpa. Tomorrow is esok. So, jumpa, jumpa lagi, see you again. Jumpa esok, see you tomorrow. Esok. Number 14, jumpa if you esok. talk with Europeans and you're not really fluent, when they speak, maybe they tend to speak very fast, Jumpa. then you can say to them, would you speak Jumpa. more slowly? So, in Malay, boleh tak awak cakap slow situ? Wait. Boleh tak? Boleh tak awak cakap slow sikit? That's hard. Awak cakap slow sikit. Awak cakap Boleh cakap is can. Tak is from word tidak which means not. Awak is you. Speak is cakap. Slow is lambat or perlahan. So when you mention slow, you either refer to the noise or you refer to the pace between words. This one, if somebody talking loud, then you can also say this one. Boleh tak awak cakap slow sikit? In English, it's like, can you lower down slow. your voice? Boleh tak awak cakap <coughs> slow sikit? Or it's also, we could you speak more slowly? Cakap Boleh tak slow awak cakap sikit. slow sikit? So there's two meanings in that phrase. Or you can also say, boleh tak jangan cakap laju? Oh, boleh tak jangan cakap laju sangat? This is jangan correct for speaking. Boleh tak sangat. jangan cakap laju? Please, boleh tak awak? Boleh tak jangan cakap laju, laju sangat? Sure, actually. Boleh is can. Tak is from the tidak, which means not. Jangan don't. Okay. Cakap speak. Laju is fast. Laju sangat. Very fast. It's like, laju you don't sangat. talk fast. Or could you you are very laju fast. sangat. Like that, that so, I repeat again. Laju okay. sangat. Boleh tak awak cakap slow sikit? Slow is English slow word. Sikit, but as please. I said, sometimes if English word is easier for us to say. Tina, Tina. Cakap slow sikit. Please. <laughs> See, I'm using it already. But I'm just kidding, guys. Then I will own word. So, boleh tak awak cakap slow sikit? Boleh tak jangan cakap laju? Boleh tak jangan cakap laju sama? Cakap I think laju. that's the three laju phrases sama. you will use for this. I'm, and then you can also say, I do I'm actually know. also copying her pitch. That is, um, that is uh, my... What do you call it? My weakness. When I try to copy someone speak, I also tend to copy the pitch. And unfortunately, she is a woman, so her pitch is higher. <laughs> and it's a struggle for me to copy her pitch, and I need to focus to be not copying her pitch, only the pronunciation. I don't know if you guys also have that kind of struggle, but I do. So, anyway. I don't understand is saya tak faham. Saya, saya tak, tak faham. faham. I is saya. For this one, saya tak, tak is from the word tidak, which means not. Saya, understand is faham. I don't faham. understand, saya tak faham. Or you can also ask, this is number 16. Do you understand me? So do you awak understand faham. me in Malay? Awak faham tak? Awak is you. Awak faham, faham is tak? Understand tak is from the word tidak, which means not. Awak you understand faham tak? Something like that if you don't understand. Or you can also ask, awak faham tak apa saya cakap? Apa is apa what? Saya, saya is I, cakap is 
speak you understand or not what I speak basically that's the meaning so you understand or not what I speak that's when you direct translate number 17 could you repeat what you said just um, now this is getting Malay. harder and harder boleh tak awak ulang cakap so sikit Tina Tina very fast lah boleh tak awak ulang apa awak cakap tadi could you please repeat what you just said boleh tak awak ulang apa awak cakap tadi that's hard guys oh my gosh ulang apa awak cakap tadi okay. so boleh so i noticed that you guys pronounce like for example apa here in the philippines it's like apa apa in malaysia is that correct um, so that is the main struggle for me, being a Filipino trying to learn Malaysian, because uh, we just pronounce that as apa, and our C doesn't sound um, ch. It's same with the letter K. So cakap in the Philippines is gonna be kakap. So and also you don't pronounce K at the end of the words, right? So it's gonna be awak here in the Philippines, but you guys just pronounce it as Awa. And somebody who's trying to learn Malay should remember those things in order for him or her to really grasp um, the language. Anyway, let's go on. That is not, Awa is you, Ulang is repeat, Apa is what, oh, Ulang is, is repeat. you, Cakap is speak, Tadi is just now. So, just now. could you repeat what you said just now? Boleh tak Awa Ulang, Apa Awa Cakap Tadi? I like your explanation actually. It's just that it's fast. So, in Malay, Boleh tak Awa Tolong Saya? Boleh tak Awa Tolong Saya? Boleh tak Awa Tolong Saya? Boleh is can, Boleh tak is Awa Tolong Saya? Tidak is not, Awa is you, Tolong is help. Boleh tak awak tolong saya? Boleh tak awak tolong saya? Cakap Melayu. Number nineteen, which maybe you really need. If you wanna scream help, then you can say tolong. Tolong. Okay, tolong. Help, tolong, tolong. It's the same here in the Philippines. If you wanna say it's a thief, then you say pencuri, pencuri, tolong, pencuri. And last one, number twenty. Repeat, please. Tolong ulang. Please oh, hear also tolong. This is confusing. To differentiate that, please watch my piece video. So repeat please. Tolong, tolong ulang. Is also I have ulang. to mention here okay. for this video, please watch my pronounce video. Okay. We are family video and also okay. Malaysian honorifics video. So you use the right pronouns to address somebody. Okay. I guess that's all my lesson for now. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you and so much, Tia. Please check out my Patreon page so that I can have more time to make more videos. Okay. For those of you who support me through this media, thank you very much. I really appreciate that. And thanks to you who watching now. I guess that's all our lesson for today. See you again in the next lesson. Bye. Bye. Should I say... Salamat. I remember Salamat Tinggal. Awa is you. Tolong. Um, ulang is repeat. Um, <laughs> chaka is speak or or say something. Um, wow. Tina Amir, um, thank you for for teaching us how to speak um, Malay. And I actually liked your channel. I mean your video because. The explanation is um, in detail so the only thing I'm commenting about is the pace probably is because I jumped into this video and if I probably if I started from this from the start I wouldn't be finding this uh, to be really fast anyway I enjoyed it and I learned something thank you so much for your time in watching this video guys I know I've been messing up with with your words in Malay but I really wanted to learn Malay and it would help me out in my covers you know because I've been making covers of Malay songs lately and yes if you like this video please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and if you like my channel please don't forget to subscribe because it really means a lot to me guys and we are about to hit 100,000 subscribers really soon we are now at almost 90,000 subscribers so thank you thank you so much guys and yes I hope to see all of you on my next videos Bye.
keikhlasan hatiku padamu Betapa ku mencoba Mendapatkan secepis kasihmu Apakah kau tak mampu untuk menentukan Di antara kaca dan permata Betapa telahanmu Memaksaku mengundangkan diri Seharusnya aku bertemu dirimu di dunia ini Dan kau membuang diriku sesuka hati